Hello designers, I am excited to introduce my latest creation for the design community. The Easy Color and Token Generator plugin for Figma. This innovative tool is specially crafted to enhance the workflow of designers, making color and token management more efficient and streamlined. You can find the plugin in the Figma community and it designed for seamless integration with your design process. For those who required unlimited access, we offer a license key available for purchase on Gumroad. You will find the link in the description below. In this video, I will provide a comprehensive walkthrough of the EasyColor plugin. I will demonstrate how it can significantly speed up your design process, allowing you to focus more on creativity and less on the manual input. Stay tuned as we dive into the feature and functionalities of this powerful tool and see how it can transform your design process. So let's dive in. You need to go to Figma community and search Easy Color and Token Generator. And the plugin is right there. Once you open the plugin, as you see, I have already bookmarked this plugin for the convenience. We'll run a quick test. As you see in the drop down in the develop version development version and the publish version because i have the access for the development version right now i'm going to walk through the published version okay so i'm going to click here and as you see this is the this is the color and token generator plugin user interface and there is two type of option available right now one is color wheel and second is the custom color so if you want, you can generate your color from color wheel and you can input your custom color in here. Also, as you see, there is secondary color and the tertiary color. Also, if you want, you can delete any of those color if you want. Okay. And as you see, the primary color is already selected. And if you click any of those color, you can see the color palette from the right hand side. Also, you can see the color name and also the contrast ratio okay and the hex code and the token okay so right now i'm going to create a complementary color palette and this is my default color and also there is one more thing that i forget to add also you can add the symmetric color or the functional color okay so i have already added a few default value in there so it will automatically create the color style palette for you or you can also remove any of those color if you don't need okay so i'm going to remove the info color from here also you can change the color from sliding uh, this hue slider and i'm going to back to previous version okay so i'm going to hit the generate and it will take very small amount of time to create a style color style sheet okay so now as you see there is a neutral color it will uh, create it based on your the primary color that you choose there is secondary color positive color negative color and the warning color also there is two type of color is base and base color white and dark also when you created uh, this style shade it will also import that color value into your figma local variable as you see you can see the neutral, primary, secondary, tertiary, continuity, positive, negative, warning, and info. As you see, we already delete uh, the info color. That's why it's totally black. If you want, you can turn off the visibility in any of those color if you want. So if I want to remove or turn off the visibility, so just hit there. Okay. So as you see, it's already removed. Okay. So... One more thing that I need to share with you, if you want to update this color style, you need to just open the plugin again. And all you have to do, you just need to select the color style. And right now, as you see, there is split uh, version of this color. And right now I'm going to choose the square on. Okay, so there is four type of color. So all I need to do, I just need to update the color. Okay. As you see, already added those uh, tertiary and continuary color in here. So if you want, you can just simply go to your local variable and you can see all the color is available here. 
so this is uh, the first version of my plugin there is a lot of things are coming very soon so if you have any question if you have any suggestion if you have any ideas so feel free to leave a comment and also you can find uh, this product on the product hunt if you like this plugin please uh, rate us and also if you need uh, to use unlimited time and lifetime so you can purchase the license key from the gumroad and the link will given description below okay that's all for today i will talk to you very soon with my next update till now tata -ta.